What's up, people? Joe Winko here, your favorite Hawaiian guy. And welcome to my first ever live stream on my new YouTube channel. And Happy New Year 2013, everybody! Unfortunately, I wasn't able to create this YouTube channel before the clock struck midnight, but at least I got it created on the first day of the year. And at least we all lived to see year 2013. I'm so glad we didn't end up dying in the 2012 apocalypse either, but I kind of knew that that wasn't going to happen anyway. Only idiots believed that. Not sure if anyone's watching me right now, but I finally finished uploading all eight of my knifed movies that I made with Grand Theft Auto San Andreas way back in year 2011. I had them all backed up on my flash drives. Thank God for those. Oh sweet! Looks like I'm getting a call! My first guest call for the night. I wonder who it is. Let's find out. Oh my god, Avril! Yeah, Avril! How are you doing tonight? I'm so hyped to talk to you again. I'm doing great, Joe Winko. Why did you delete your old YouTube channel? Because I didn't like the username on my old YouTube channel, really. I could never figure out what it could be. But I came up with Winko567 and I felt like it fit perfectly. Ah, well I'm glad you got the Knifed movies back up again. Those are my favorite. How old are you right now? 16? 17? Actually, I'm 13 years old right now. Really? You look a lot older than that. Aw, thank you, Avril. But for the love of God, please do not say that to me 10 years from now. <laughs> I promise. Ghostface is a really scary killer. But you should really make a movie about the werewolf game. Werewolves? Really? Not werewolves. The werewolf game. There's a bunch of Japanese novels about it, and now it's even managed to become an internet urban legend. It doesn't actually have werewolves, but the legends do have a lot of death, murder, and mayhem. Really? I've never heard of the werewolf game. What's it actually about, then? According to the legend, every now and then, a group of random people are kidnapped, and they all wake up in a scary building that's rigged with security cameras. None of them have any idea on how they got there, but their every move is being watched on camera by the evil organization that kidnapped them. Bound around their necks are killer collars that will detonate and kill them if they disobey the rules or refuse to cooperate. They all wake up in front of a TV that tells them that they have been selected to play a real-life werewolf game. What is the werewolf game? It's a social deduction game. Think of it as a very complex version of the Hunger Games. In the game, everyone gets assigned a role, of either the werewolves or the villagers. Most of the people chosen for the game are of the villagers' role, while a small minority of them 
are the werewolves' role. Every day, everyone must gather in the center of the house and vote on who they think the werewolf is. And whoever gets the most votes gets executed by their collar detonating. Oh my god! And it gets even scarier. Every night, everyone must go to their rooms. But at midnight, the werewolves must awaken and kill one person on the villagers' side. And it continues every day until the game is over. How does the game end? There's two ways the game can end. One way is if the werewolves kill off enough of the villagers till there's an equal number of werewolves and villagers left alive. If that happens, the surviving villagers are automatically executed by their callers detonating. And the werewolves win the game, and are finally able to exit the building, alive. But what about the villagers? Another way the game can end, is if the villagers successfully vote off all the werewolves to be executed. Then the villagers win the game, and they are able to exit the building alive. What happens if they don't do anything, though? As in, they try leaving the house anyway, or if they don't vote to have anyone executed, or if the werewolves don't kill anyone at night. If the werewolves don't kill anyone at night, then the werewolves team will automatically die by being executed by their callers detonating. And if everyone else doesn't vote on who they think the werewolf is during the daytime, and they all fail to have a player executed during the voting session, then everyone automatically dies by their callers detonating, and no one survives. So, what do you think of that, Joe Winko? Well, it sounds very... complicated, if you ask me. <laughs> Good one! <laughs>